Don't you open up that window Don't you let out that antidote Popping pills is all we know Hi guys, it's Lane here and today on my channel I am going to be doing a back to school clothing haul and all of this is online by the way I went to uh, online to Forever 21 Victoria's Secret For, okay, Forever 21, Victoria's Secret, or Pink, Urban Outfitters, oh, I went to Walmart, and I think I did one more store, I'm pretty sure, but I hope you guys enjoy, and just let's get on to the video. So I'm going to start with what I'm wearing real quick, so this bralette that I am wearing is from Urban Outfitters, and this shirt, uh, is from forever 21 and it kind of just goes down like that it's very uh short okay so everything that i have right here which you guys can't see in the frame i have gotten over summer and stuff like that and i'll try to remember all the stores that i got them from but oh forgetting what i got from kohl's and I got them over summer as well. Okay, starting with the first thing. This is from Urban Outfitters. And again, it's another bralette. They had like $16 bralettes for, I'm pretty sure, like 16 So I spent money on five bralettes. And I'm wearing a black one. A gray one. I think I have a maroon one somewhere in here. So this next one... I got from a store in Gatlinburg and, well, Gatlinburg, Tennessee, if you didn't know. And it, I'm pretty sure the name of it was Jonathan's, if I can remember correctly. And it's just this, like, very thin material and I love it. Hoodie and, I don't know if you can see, but it says Smoky Mountain National Park on it. And I got it for school. Most, like, all of the stuff I got for school, um, except for, like, one or two things. But I could still wear them in school. I would just have to be very careful on it. Oh, it's hot. So I got that. And then some of these are worn. Like, I just, I wore them. Like, this one I think I wore last night or yesterday. I'm so out of breath. I am so sorry. And if I'm talking really fast, just tell me in the comments. This is a maroon uh, shirt. And I got this. I don't even know where I got this. But I thought it was cute. And I don't really have a lot of maroon things. Again, just says Smoky National Park. The back doesn't have anything on it. This one I think I got from Hollister. If I can just find the tag. I'm pretty sure I got this. No, it's not from Hollister. I think this is from American Eagle, if I'm pretty sure. Yeah, this is from American Eagle. And I'm pretty sure. If not, it's from like, um, I'm trying to think that store name. Abercrombie and Fitch. Finch, I don't know how to say it correctly, but it's just this off the shoulder, off the, off the shoulder top. And if you follow me on, I'm pretty sure Instagram and or Snapchat, you know this is my holy grail. Like I love this. I thought I was gonna hate it honestly, but I got it and I think it's cute. Ow, my leg hurts. This is from, oh, American Eagle. Yeah, American Eagle. This is from American Eagle. And so was that. Um, I got this very, like, I guess, like, it looks huge. It, I honestly, like, it looks bigger. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Who knows? It looks bigger than what it actually is. But what is this? Like, I feel like this is, I don't know. Maybe I'm tripping. I'm sorry. <laughs> and it's very, like, 
it's kind of cr it's cropped but it's not too cropped if you wear it with like leggings or something or high-waisted jeans but it's very cute and i'm excited to try to wear this at school because it's cute and and this is another holy grail of mine like i always wear this i feel like i just wear the same thing over again because i like it and then i wear it so much that i actually hate it uh that's kind of what happens in my closet not gonna lie there's some things where i haven't even uh used them at all and some of them are just like hand-me-downs from people that get give away their clothes so yeah and like i think i like them but then i'm like oh no like that's ugly like what the heck were you thinking i got this shirt from gatlinburg also and i'm pretty sure it was it's like the mountain mall and like you can go like there's so many levels to this mall and they keep getting smaller and smaller and i got it at like one of the top stores and I thought it was cute because I wanted something like this. It just says Great Smoky Mountains, you know. This is from Jonathan's. Yeah, this is from Jonathan's. My mom was wearing one of these shirts and like I wasn't with her when she got this shirt. But I wanted to twin with her because... They're like very cute basketball, basketball, um, baseball tees, and they're just really cute. And it just says Smoky Mountains, and then it was established in 1934. Genuine, I can't read. I can't read, I'm sorry. Genuine Article National Park. So it was cute, and I thought it. I paid like $30 for that shirt. Um, this one was just included because I got it over the summer as well. Like just like anything. But I work at Publix and I ordered one of these from my boss. And I never got one when everyone was wearing it in like April I'm pretty sure. Or some crazy like month like that or something. And I saw everyone wearing it but I ordered it. And there was just leftovers so she, my boss just gave it to me. Because I said I don't recall ordering one. I thought I, I said I don't recall because I literally didn't know at that point. Because it was just so long ago if I actually ordered one or not. But uh, yeah. I got this from Kohl's. It's very cute. The only th bad thing about this shirt is that I don't like it's very kind of like low on the top part and so it goes very low on the bottom so i'm not really i don't really wear this a lot but eventually when i get a bigger torso if i ever do i'll wear it but i think it's cute like i've worn it before like don't get me wrong like i spent my money on it but you know you know it's just things you really like and then they don't turn out to, uh, yeah. I don't know if I said, but I got that at Kohl's. I got this at the same one that I got the gray shirt from in Gatlinburg, Tennessee. This one just says summer of 2018, Gatlinburg, Tennessee. You know, just cute, cute little, uh, thing. So this is where I spent most of my money this portion and I literally have been getting this all week last week so this if I'm right is from Urban Outfitters and there's a background story behind this one it's like really soft but I thought it was gonna be like very like I didn't think it was gonna be big but I did get a large so It'll definitely be pajamas and not for school, but I just wanted to include it because I've got it for back to school. This I got from Pink, obviously, if you can see. And I would say size up if you're gonna get like this stretchier, like top part, size up. 
I should have sized up because I know online sometimes you can get smaller orders. Um, I definitely should have sized up on it just for this, but it like it fits perfectly. But I am trying to lose weight for the new summer coming up, or spring break, or uh, winter, whatever comes first. So I'm definitely gonna fit into them. Um, yeah, they're very cute though. Like a lot of people, I feel like are gonna like hate me for wearing like type this type because like everyone knows like these were in style like the like different patterns and stuff were in style like a long time ago but now they're not okay for urban outfitters if you're gonna get like tommy hilfiger or something like that i would definitely say for at least tommy hilfiger size down is my best advice if you're gonna order from these and all of these were on sale by the way i don't know the t prices um i got a medium and i should have gotten with a small but it still fits like perfectly but like at the top you definitely have to for me i definitely have to fold or go like this like kind of like where you put it like up so it's kind of like that because you know everyone wants to see the banner but I think it's cute and the thing that I really liked about it that caught my eye and I spent $40 for is Hilfair on the name I've always wanted something like that and I got it I got it girl I got it this is going to be so long. This is from Urban Outfitters as well. I'm pretty sure. Cute little tie. If I can find the other one. Little tie thing. I didn't tie it and it fit perfectly. Um, I would say get your size for this one. It looks very small. But once you put it on it kind of like lags down which is good I guess for those girls who really want to get down if you know what I mean I'm just kidding but um this you can already tell is pink and I got this because I thought it was cute I should have gotten the black not gonna lie but I still like it I paid god like $30 for it so I'm still gonna wear it to school definitely with high leggings or jeans I feel like for me jeans are really hard because I'm in between sizes and I'm not even gonna like fret over this it's underwear for crying out loud so like everyone wears it but I just got this cute little underwear cheeky you know another bralette from, oh, that was pink, by the way, if you didn't know. If you didn't get the hint. This is the maroon bralette that I was talking about. Definitely, I love Urban Outfitters bralettes. This is my first time ever trying bralettes. And, excuse me. And I really like them. Yeah. So... This I got from Forever 21. Oh, no. Urban Outfitters. And if you're going to get something like this from, like, Urban Outfitters or anywhere, I would definitely say size up one or two. I could have sized up two. Like, it's not tight, but I definitely like it to be flowy. And these aren't the problem. It's the band part. It's, like the opening it's not big enough but again I'm definitely trying to lose weight for the summer or spring break or whatever happens so yeah so that's what's happening this is from forever 21 the only thing I don't like about this is the feeling of the velvet I definitely wanted to try it I really like it won't be putting my hands on the velvet part like this part 
but I really like it. I would definitely wear it for school. Now, my school is definitely one of those schools who has dress code. They don't really like you wearing, like, crop top, but if you wear, like, if you wear, like, spaghetti strap, you have to have something over it. And if you're wearing crop top, you have to have high-waisted jeans. You can get away with that. Um, some places you can't. Some schools you really can't. But my school is okay with it. They're just not, like, the biggest fans of it, depending on which you, which person you run into. Now, this one, I definitely ran into the trend, the Adidas three-stripe trend. I had one, and... It was too big and it was the only size that I could get at PacSun. So I bought it anyway and it was just a little bit too big. So I gave it to Goodwill and I found this on Urban Outfitters. And I was like, I can't pass it up because they actually have a medium. Mediums are definitely the rarest things to find for anything. Wherever you are, wherever you're shopping. Because medium is definitely... Uh, average size for everybody I definitely do like it the only thing that I don't is because I'm like I'm trying to lose weight it's harder for me to fit into them like at the top because they go like you know kind of like a like that so they go like I don't know if that makes sense but uh, I don't know where I got this from Oh, I got this from Forever 21. This is the other thing that I said you should size up on. Um, again, but I wouldn't even want to wear it because I'm a little self-conscious about my body. But I'm definitely trying to buy it so, like, I can be, like, yeah, like, cool. Like, when I actually want to wear something like that and when I feel good about myself. You know, not that I don't because I do. This is from Urban Outfitters, and I really like it. This is, like, one of the things that I fell in love with when I first saw it. I was like, hell yes, girl. Urban Outfitters is definitely another store of mine. I'm going to finish these. So, this is another pair of pink underwear. Kind of same, literally the same exact style. Just purple instead of pink. And... I was definitely going out of my comfort zone with this one because I didn't know how I felt about it. I don't think I've worn these yet, but the only thing that I don't like or like I didn't know if I was going to like is the kind of like the material on the top, the stripes, who knows. Here's the other two bralettes that I have. Um, I love all of these bralettes. Um, these are in medium large style though they don't have like your bra size which i don't even know my bra size so it's kind of just going off of what i could but it definitely fits and yeah same thing here and if you guys, I don't know why my nose is so red all of a sudden, but it looks like a freaking Rudolph just came and spit in my face. Okay, so if you guys want me to do a try-on portion, like another video try-on portion, I can. Um, I can, if you want. Okay, so this one isn't really for school. But I saw it and I'm like, this is totally me. It says, not today. Yeah, and it's kind of like a hoodie style shirt, I guess. Or muscle tee, if you will. This I got from, uh, I'm pretty sure, Urban Outfitters. Again, I shopped and I bought $300 worth of clothes at Urban Outfitters. Uh, definitely am happy about it. okay so the only thing I would say is I don't like the little like waistband in the middle but after, overall like I would definitely wear it this one is from forever 21 
and it's another like hoodie style but it's not really like muscle tee it's kind of just like shirt hoodie shirt if that makes sense it's really cute and I like it for the last two things I got these pair of shoes from Ross and these are US polo and I got them really cute haven't really worn them yet and I don't even know what I would wear these with but uh yeah so I can't show I can't show this but I got this bag and everything that's like in it right now my wallet and stuff didn't come with it like this extra stuff didn't come with it but I really like it. It's velvet. Again, I'm not really with that velvet crazy. I'm not really velvet crazy at the moment. I could be. But it's my school bag. And I do have Chromebooks. And my Chromebook is literally the size of a notebook. So, yeah. And I really hope you guys enjoyed. Again, if you guys want me to do a try-on portion where I try on all my new clothes, I can. Uh, it's first back to school video and I'm really excited for you guys and I am so sorry that I have been gone. I literally, I've been just do, do I've been do, I've been so strung up and strung up. I've been so held back on boy problems and school, like ending a school and stuff like that and... I am definitely going to make more videos for you guys. This is going to go up. I'm not really going to edit my videos. I'm going to keep them raw. I feel like another thing is that I wasn't being myself. And I guess I wasn't really into it as much as per se I was when a long time ago. So we're going to change that. And I hope you guys enjoy. And... Give a like, subscribe, give a thumbs up, do all that jazz, and I will see you in my next video. I'm going to try to do once a week, too.